I refuse to believe it. If the Lord Chancellor will permit me, I can I will not permit! And you will say nothing more of these ridiculous suspicions! All the years I've known your father, never have I seen him so obstinate! Your allegations strike at the very heart of the Empire. I fear he cannot sustain another blow as great as the loss of Mallory. All he need do is journey to Blackwall Yard! For what evidence? The destruction was total. A clear case of arson, according to Commissioner Doyle. Apparently, a small group of rebels was seen on the docks. It was all rather... What is the word the Commissioner is so fond of? Oh, yes, elementary. Now, what do you think? I have no opinion. Should you wish, I can attempt to persuade the Lord Chancellor to put the matter before the Council. If it is true that we have a traitor in our midst, word is bound to get back to the conspirators. What do you propose? Breach the walls of the United India House under cover of night. Any information that will shed light on the events of the last few days must surely be found there. Trespass on the Company's headquarters. You are cut from the same cloth as Mallory. Drastic circumstances call for drastic measures. Oh. I would have your assistance, Alistair. I hardly think it proper for the Knight Commander to be you seen... You know the lay of the land. I will need your guidance to navigate the grounds of the United India House. If a conspiracy is to be revealed, your testimony will carry weight with your father. Very well. The two of us alone will not suffice to infiltrate the compound. If what you say is true, there are precious few we can trust. My sister, Lafayette. I cannot involve them until I have more evidence. Then who? I might know just the person who can help us. I thank you, brother. We're approaching the United India House. I assume we're not planning to enter through the front door. Not to worry. I've made preparations for our incursion. Gaining access to the compound proved to be a little more difficult than planned. Entrance to the compound. You could say that. It won't be long before the truth is revealed. Is everything in place? Sebastian. As discussed, ordinances on the table, rooftop accesses to the bedroom. You've done well, Francis. At your service, sir. Mm. Francis served in the Commonwealth forces. Crossbow. Brings back memories. Ancient ones at that. 
Thought it best we stay silent on this mission. Let's get going. Compound is patrolled all through the night. Guards man all entrances. What's the incursion point? The gardens. Should provide us enough cover to move in unnoticed. Follow me. Should head to the rooftops. This intelligence does pan out. A trustworthy man, it seems. Not really. He has a debt to repay. Failure to deliver on his word would prove most unpleasant to him. We need to find a safe anchor point in the garden to secure the rope to. Quite a gazebo seems to fit the parameters. Good. Let's deploy the line. Done. Alistair, I need you to stay here and spot my path. Once I'm clear, I'll give you the go-ahead to enter. Very well. I do be careful. My sister wouldn't forgive me if I were to return alone. What she doesn't know cannot hurt her.
There are still more guards to search. What's next? Clear the west wing. I'll move through the east. It would be wise to stay the communicator from here on. Good point. Yeah. Let's rendezvous inside.
My gallant knight. It seems I came just in time. I suppose so. Though it would not be in my nature to let a god get the better of me. Did you come alone? Devin and Finley are with me. They're taking care of the rest of the guards and you. I could not risk involving my squad, but there is one more with me. And you trust this person? Yes. With my life. Very well. What now? We will meet him inside and proceed to the archives room. Let's go. As you can see, we face some resistance. They're over here. Rani, we found a way in. Once in place, we can use the stagecoach to climb the balcony.
Knight, help us push this into place. I need you to stay. Rani, I need to be by your side. You always are, child. What of him and his accomplice? Heed my advice. Do you not know how dear you are to me? Then why do you push me away? Because I need you to continue the cause if something happened to me. Do not say that. Debbie, though you may not trust me, know that I will protect your queen in your stead. I owe her knew that much. See that you do. You do not want to get on the bad side of that one. 